was respected. That was a custom hand. The custom was not run like this when I was. It was purely anti smuggling without causing life. Collecting revenue without being too without being corrupt. Those are the two things we have to to protect the natural properties of Nigeria around the world. So now that uh, this thing uh, this is started this constant killing started during the militarization of that particular organization and started shouting. Even I even lost a cousin. Lost a customer. You see tomorrow now we have not seen a dead body. Now they are killing smugglers. Smugglers now have already they have started to kill them too. But uh, the way they are now, it's all rampage all over the region. It's so, very, very unconstant. To be killing people, to collect duty, to be killing people before you can arrest money. So, but now that we have a new administration in place, who is a train of customers automatically, it will help you. I think what is, going, what is being now is to go around and synthesize the people and train them, bring their brains back to civilian areas. This is democracy. They have never seen custom carrying guns up and down inside town on, until the, that uh, until Ali was there. And now that it's gone, the era of killing, I'm very sure, is the put behind us. Sir, do you uh, really uh, think that uh, maybe the past administration, you, Ali, you just mentioned, really contributed much to the militarization that you just uh, mentioned? Sir? The militarization, anything that you call something on customs. It's a military, it was a military, retired military. He even brought the idea of putting a, 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 a brigadier general as a PSO to be posting officers on instructions. Automatically, the instruction you give to the officer is what they will carry out. So, military are not supposed to collect duty. Military are not supposed to man all these areas. Now that they are going here, as a brand new custom officers, brand new custom officers, you see that there will be changes. Now that the Senate has passed a vote of no confidence in those ones that are shooting, and they should be identified and removed. So custom is certainly the instruction, the rebranding. That's why we are here. Sir, so your constituency has also been uh, affected by Russia. Some of your, uh, part, some part of your constituency. Especially at Akumosa East, where the good mining has been happening. Uh, and the issue of erosion has become a national problem to Nigeria. What are you doing to help your constituents? Well, uh, the illegal mining all over. Let's say all over the country. Nasarawa, my area, that is uh, um, also East. It has been bombarded by this foreign, particularly the Chinese. Who was giving serious bank? Uh, who were giving serious banking by their last administration? They left the place unguided, and you see a lot of erosion that are really damaging the properties. Apart from that, one of the roads leading to uh, lead, the major road leading to Elisha, different Elisha, and uh, almost Akure. It's, it's almost impossible now. So, above all, my Russia that is seriously affecting my area, the Atacumas area, uh, the, all the mine areas have been taken over by serious erosion. And if this rain, if it is not prevented, you see a lot of death already, we have been recording death. So, my own uh, advice is what we did to do that we are going to look at it only specifically. All those areas affected, put a memo to the public memo to Mr. President. So even if it's means to borrow money and face that particular moment, we see that the erosion will be a thing of the past. And the, ray, the roads now will be repaired. Thank you, sir. Sir, on the issue of uh, recruitment into the customs, uh, Nigeria, Nigeria believed that uh, 
the recruitment process is not really properly done. And this is contributing to the menace, the issue of incessant uh, killing. What is no, no background check on the recruits, and this is really, you know, affecting the system. So, and what do you have to say on this? Generally, all the recruitment we are doing now, they are all emergency. From now, the ones that are there, the trainings are not enough. And that is why you say, when you, you observe some officers that they are not competent enough to handle arms and ammunition, you don't need. So, by the grace of God, now that this thing has been put behind us, we will see what we can do. And the security agents are not enough to man more than 200 million. Because some maybe they are just less than 25. What would they do at the border? They need a lot, a lot of uh, junior officers to man this place. And uh, by the time you train them, it's been almost six months. That's the shortest time you can train people on these custom matters here and there, including uh, the banning of arms and ammunition, including uh, psychological training, how to how to relate with the other You are relating with human beings, you are not relating with animals. Even animals nowadays, you don't shoot anyhow. That is why the branding will be very, very important. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.